Anyway, hello everybody, welcome to Bolt Throw game number 5. 100 TV down against Chaos. Um, I don't even know what I've got on this team. 70k, good. Good, I haven't got... I haven't done anything wrong here. What's this? Block, dodge. Dodge, dodge. I don't even know what to do with 100k. Maybe he's got two babes. Maybe he's just getting an apple. Um, he's got tents, which is good for him, isn't it? Claw, which won't do a lot. A fair amount of block, which is pretty good for him. This is a bit of a crap, uh, a crap TV difference. I guess I could just spend my money and get a wizard, eh? Just spend my money, get a wizard. Fair enough. <laughs> Hello, Shawnee. <laughs> Yeah, it's crazy, isn't it, the AI, like... <laughs> you got an... It's not... <laughs> okay, it's pretty scummy, but... There's just not much I can get for a thousand, is there? Like, a hundred thousand, I can get, like... An apple or two babes. Neither one's very appealing. I'd rather just get a... Like, neither one makes up for the disadvantage... Of him having five more skills. Whereas um, a wizard, a wizard does. BLGF. <laughs> yeah, bribe. I guess a bribe wouldn't be awful either. Oh, he's only got one reroll. Okay, had I realised he only had one reroll. So really his extra TV is only two skills and a reserve. Which isn't that terrifying. So maybe I shouldn't have got a maybe I should have gone for an apple. I don't know. Maybe I should have just gone for the apple. Got no idea how yet he... I mean, I should have... The teams would be fairer. To be fair, it might have been confused by, like, you know, the strength six and tentacles and everything. So if I was to do a, an actual fair test, it would be, you know, 1,000 TV um, and do it from the start of the game rather than the second half. But it was just like a spur-of-the-moment thing, wasn't it? Uh, right. Where's the rookie catcher? This one. Oh, he's... He's got a lopsided setup here, hasn't he? I mean, I guess I could just serve him. Push him to there, push him to there. And then serve him. I guess it's worth, worth trying that. Rookie one can go for the pick up and then obviously don't want anyone near the tents. So he blocks him to there, he pushes him to there, and some random dude just blitzes him. Seems seems ridiculously easy, doesn't it? They are they are just elves on a twenty seven. They are professional elves, yeah. They're just elves. Just elves. They're Blood Bowl elves. Ex-pro players before the NAF collapsed. Right. Let's just see what happens here, first of all. Okay, so it looks like we are going for the surf.
No surf. Blitz him, seeing as there's a the balls kind of exposed, isn't it? Put two guys on one. Do you remember two guy for Blackburn? Uh, so yeah, I guess one, two, three, four, five, six. Have to re-roll this if it's a failure. Yeah. Sure enough, it is. But now that's. I guess he could surf him with double GFI, but I don't think he would go for that. I don't, is there anything you can do here? Nothing that I'm super afraid of, I don't think. You could serve him as well, couldn't he? But who cares? Hello, VIP Sledger. <laughs> yeah, PC. Yeah, two guy. I, always, I often think of him whenever I say two guys. I always think of two guys. <laughs> Maybe I should have uh, had the blitzer here so that he couldn't have been surfed. And then I. But I mean, if he if he makes two GFIs, if he makes two GFIs to surf with a with a minor, that's that's fifty fifty to make the two to make the two pluses. Never mind the uh, block dice. So. And then he's using his uh, he's using his blitz and he's taking his mino completely out of the game because I just switched to the other side. So if he does go for the surf, I think he you know he's fucked. I don't know. <laughs> oh, Grindel. Um Well, Matt. Well, first of all, there's no need to insult people. You know, there's no need to insult people. Um, Second of all, I think tens first on a mino is is kind of yeah okay. I would go claw every single time, but um, tentacles is is quite valid, isn't it? Like it's not it's not objectively wrong. Uh, yeah, claw generally first on a mino on a beast isn't great, but you know he might be worried about orcs and dwarves and be confident of beating other people. So you know it's. <laughs> yes, I, just, I don't like. I, I don't want to. I don't want to. You know, I really didn't like it. I really didn't like it when Lupak was in was insulting all of his in, in, opponents all the time. I really didn't like that. So no, I, I'm. I don't like insulting people. To be honest. Blood Bowl's Mr. Nice. Oh wow, he dodged away. Yeah, exactly. Blood Bowl's Mr. Nice. Right, I could do. Wow, he can just. Ha Isn't he fast? He's like a shit gutter runner. So he could hand off to the dodge guy or the blitzer. He could block him. Could blitz him and make a big. Uh, make a big move around here. I guess I should have got it at the catcher actually rather than Blitzer, but Blitzer's just safer, isn't he? Oh shit, he's got dodge. Alright. How does that change things then? I 
surf him pretty easily, but the ball's exposed, isn't it? I really want to hand off to him. All right, to do that, then think about what to do afterwards. Oh yeah, also the catcher's got catch, hasn't he? So I really, probably really should go to the catcher. Um. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we could just sideline it there. Not great, is it? One dice block. Right. Oh fuck. Oh well. <laughs> Was looking for a push and then I could have dodged and surfed, couldn't I? Maybe I shouldn't have gone for the surf, maybe I should have just gone for the dodge blitz. And then move him up. Was being a bit greedy, maybe I shouldn't have done. Yeah, remember that, El Mato, yeah. Remember that. He ain't got block. That's his one reroll gone. No, oh, God. I should have, uh, should have got the extra apple, maybe. <laughs> However, let's also not forget that Dode, uh, Dode, I think, believe it. Does he have a losing record with that Orc team? Or, uh, or it's certainly not a winning record. It's not a good record. He might have won two more than he's lost. I think he's lost more than he's won with that team. Conclusive proof that the Orc throw is amazing. <laughs> That's very true, actually. That is very true. He was very gentlemanly. Um, right, I would really like to score with him, wouldn't I? Which means getting him around for a while. He could block him. And then he could blitz him. Then he could surf him. But it's. I would like to also score maybe next turn. Could just block with him and blitz with him later. No, I think I've got a block here, haven't I? I don't. I'm not going to surf this guy. So. Got him. Guess just go there. I like that with sidestep you can go on the sideline properly all the time. Good tentacles man there. 
The GFI would make this a screen, but does it even matter? One, two, three, four, five, six. Like, it not being a screen doesn't really matter, I don't think, so it can just stay there. <laughs> Johnny. <laughs> yeah, on that, I was thinking about it. You can make the elf, elfic coalition or whatever and have two wood elf throwers, two high elf throwers, two two dark elf runners and uh, two pro elf throwers. I mean, to be fair, kickoff return is is pretty good for an orc thrower because he's fucking movement five instead of movement six. <laughs> and to be fair, to be fair, Dode's team that he posted looked completely badass. However, he had, the, the point is, not that you, like, uh, Zunk, Zunk it was in fact, uh, was talking about orc throwers and he said, the other argument is that you skill up your first orc Blitzer to get you a hand, and then that is the not the argument at all. The argument is nobody gets your hands. The argument is that you want all of your blitzers to have guard and mighty blow, and tackle and piling on. And how do they get these skills? By fucking scoring touchdowns because of three star player points, isn't it? First game, a random blitzer carries, scores two touchdowns, gets guard. Second game, random blitzer carries, scores two touchdowns, gets mighty blow. Third game, random blitzer carries, scores two touchdowns, gets guard. Fourth game, random blitzer carries, scores two touchdowns, gets guard. And now in four games, you've got three guard and one mighty blow. But if you've got a fucking thrower, the fucking thrower has scored eight goal, eight touchdowns in, in four games. <laughs> <laughs> and now he's on now he's on 24 star player points and he's got block and kickoff return and you fucking and you fucking all oh, blitzers have got fuck all so you know it's uh it's not good is it ah well it's different it's different when you've got to win at all costs isn't it that's the thing jelly jelly deal and you know that that's the other that's the other thing right if if it um if you have to if you have to win and people are using wood elves then yes of course you don't want uh you don't want oh my god you don't want uh people you don't want to lose to wood elves do you so you know, then you don't want to be orcs. <laughs> yeah, that's that's a good point. That is a good point. I don't want any. I don't want anyone to get punched here. Fuck about. He could... I want to get the ball to him as well. I want to be a bit greedy and get the ball to him. He could dodge out. I mean, obviously, I was I was just going to give it to him. Or, or, you know, go down here or score. I guess scoring now gives me four turns to turn him over and score. Which is all right. Um, yeah, and then you've also got, <laughs> yeah, I said it jokingly and people, people on Reddit were like, rah, 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 Jimmy said it's pay to win. I'm like, man, I'm just having a laugh. Sorry.
I haven't got many players, have I? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I was joking, but then also, yeah, the, the best team is, is DLC. And there's no doubt the Wood Elves are the best team. There's uh, there's absolutely no doubt the Wood Elves are the best team. They're, they're the... Uh, they win it all. They win the most at all TVs in all formats. <laughs> Wood Elves always win the most. So, you know, if you're being objective about it, Wood Elves are just the best team. Um, anyway, so yeah, so it's a bit different in like tabletop tournaments and things where it's all just win at all costs, but. And also the stats as well, isn't it? If you get a stat up on your on your blitzer, let, let's say you get a plus movement on an orc blitzer, you can give him sure hands, and now he's your ball carrier. Or if you get plus edge on a, on a blitzer, like plus edge on a blitzer with mighty blow isn't that good, is it? But plus that plus edge on a blitzer, and then you give him agility, uh, then you give him sure hands. It's brilliant. <laughs> I'm getting banged on here, aren't I? It's funny that I don't like using Wood Elves despite them being the best team. It's crazy, isn't it? But I just don't like them, but... Maybe I should. Maybe I should play Wood Elves more. Oh my god, stop killing all my guys. Holy shit. <laughs> I should have got the extra apple, maybe, eh? And he got an extra reroll as well, for fuck's sake. And I've only got three dodges. Oh god, powers me blodger. I think Skaven, no, I, th I just think Skaven are the most OP in that somebody said, what's the most OP race? And I think Skaven get the two most OP mechanics, don't they? I've played plenty of Lizardmen. I think Lizardmen are ridiculous at low TV. Yeah, Brett's before they had ac agility access. Holy shit. He's fucking, he's getting good value from his fucking minor now. He's just going for the blitz. Fucking hell. This is a... This is an absolute disaster. Oh, thank God. Good. <laughs> Where is your team, Jimmy? <laughs> it's a good question, isn't it, Tony? <laughs> there they are. They're all dead. Delphs are OP. Delphs are Delphs are powerful, aren't they? But they're basically fair. <laughs> like they're really they're really powerful, but they're a bit slow and they're not they're not that crazy. Looking like it, isn't it, Fash? But somebody bullied me to play a game. 
funny that. Yeah, dark elves are slow, so so they don't they don't get they don't get uh they don't get one turns, do they? And they don't capitalize on the blood. When you think about it, right? When you think about what what are the most ridiculous things in Blood Bowl? And it is claw palm, one turns, and blitzers, and Skaven get the best from all of those. So it's uh that's why I said I thought they were the most OP. Just in the context of that quite particular question, I don't think they're uh, I don't think they're like the best race. Oh my god, are you shitting me? I get a board down so he gets a Kaz. Fuck off, man. Fuck off. This is ridiculous. This is fucking ridiculous. This is really taking the piss now, this game. Holy shit. Could probably just bolt, uh, probably fireball, couldn't I? But then it doesn't really achieve much. No, but then the bolt could be bad, couldn't it? Alright, fireball, fuck it. Oh, good. Alright, not bad. Um... Really like to two dice though, wouldn't I? Then if I two dice, I can't really protect the ball carrier. I don't want to make a three plus pickup. I guess I could. Could just do that. Dodge out to protect him. Blitz over here or something. Blitz over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, fuck it. Yeah, of course. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we can go there. Oh, fuck, that's a GFI. You shitting me. Right, I knew it'd be a one. I knew the next draw would be a one. Fucking hell. Brutal. But that, that's why. That's why he goes there. So that if I'd made the two plus fucking dodge, um, he could have blitz and then covered it, couldn't he? Fucking hell, this is, a, this is a horrible game. Just quietly. Four Kaz in five turns with, without any kill skills. Look, he's got mine, Mighty Blow on the Miner. And he had one reroll, and he's got an extra one. Now, nah, no perms at least. Yeah, no fash. I know fash. Yeah, I knew I should have done. I knew I should have done YouTube. I wanted to do YouTube. You didn't let me do YouTube. Motherfucker. Fucking fash. Fash who doesn't even fucking stream anymore. Fash who doesn't even fucking stream. Made me stream. What's up with that? What's fucking up with that? Don't even think of palling me, you motherfucker. Oh my fucking god! Wow! Holy shit!
This is ridiculous. <laughs> Fucking hell, man. What is even going on here? Yeah, sidestep the uh, elf blitzers start with sidestep, which is why he was on the sideline. I would have obviously never put him on the sideline if he didn't have sidestep. Oh my god. It would be nice if you just didn't break armor, you know, one one turn without killing a player would be great, mate. One turn without killing a player. Fucking hell. He hasn't even got mighty money, he's got claw on him, They're useless. He's just done this. In four turns. I mean if I go turn it up, it's almost safe, isn't it? But use the whiz to push for it. Yeah, of course he gets power. Yep, of course it's an armor break. Of course it's a cast. Of course it is. And both times I've wanted to apple. Both times it's been a good player. It's been a miss next game. So I can't even apple it because it wouldn't work. Like, maybe I should have appled one of the early badly hurts. But these last two weren't perms and they weren't badly hurt. So they were the worst ones to apple. This is getting pretty fucking stupid right now. I mean, he isn't scoring this. I mean, he could, he could maybe score this half, I guess. That's not in scoring, so there's no point standing him up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, GFI, GFI. All right. I probably want to blitz the ball, don't I? One, two, three, four, the five. The only thing you can do is six, out potato seven. him now. Yeah. All right, let's go. <laughs> had to be, didn't it, eh? Fucking had to be! Wow, holy shit! <sighs> Fuck! <laughs> it couldn't just be a fucking push, could it? It couldn't just fucking be a push. Oh, of course it's a pow, yeah. Yeah, mate, get another pal. Why not? <sighs> the worst thing is that you got this extra reroll. <laughs> oh, screw it, dude. Like, you probably fail this, and then you don't oh, know, and then use this free reroll, but no. Oh he's gonna foul, isn't he? Of course oh he is. Of course he's gonna foul. Fuck you. <laughs> I guess I should I should have uh, stood that guy up because he could have blitzed here. Christ. Three, four, five, six, seven. GFI. That's got to be a one dice, which is just shit, isn't it? Oh, shit, Powden. Four, five, six, seven, GFI, GFI. Three, four, five, six, seven. So he's got a GFI, hasn't he? All right, might might do it. Got to got to roll some two pluses though. Fuck. 
hooking. Was it a pal? I shouldn't have asked. Oh man, imagine if he'd made it three dice and it had been a scatter score. Oh, if he scatters it now. Oh man, imagine that! <laughs> he went for the pickup! How bad was that? Oh my god. How bad was going for that pickup then? He deserved, he deserved to concede a touchdown because of that. Alright. Well. It's not going well, is it? Fuck off, you cocksucker! Jesus fucking Christ! <laughs> Throwing the ball at a stun player. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, glue man. Um, there they all are. The uh, the linos were only badly hurt, so I didn't want to apple them because they were linos. Then the catches that I would have appled got missed next game, so you know it wasn't guaranteed to work on the good players. Uh, maybe I should have just appled the first badly hurt. Yeah, to be fair, to be fair, he is one reroll chaos, not one nil. It's it could have been worse. I mean, it should be two nil, though, shouldn't it? It really should be two nil. Um, but what can you do? <laughs> it's very dingo, glue man. <laughs> Yeah, loner elves are loner elves are. Uh, I think they're a bit crap, to be honest. I really do think loner elves are a bit crap. The reason being, any elf can do something, can't he? What I would like to do would be to just look at replays. And funnily enough, <laughs> the great Kanor said that uh, elf linemen, high elf linemen, only take hits. And I'm like, what planet are you on? Where that's all high elf linemen do. It's crazy, but yeah, lone elves need to roll. And a random elf lineman... A random elf lineman... Uh, can, you know, can do a lot of things, can't he? Like, that's the thing. The best are dwarves, because... Nah, no, the best the best are Norse. The best are Norse. It's, it's not good that you're having to field them. But they've got movement six and they've got block, so Oh my god. Blocked him blocked his path. Good. The thing is dwarves sometimes want dwarves sometimes want to go for it. That's the thing. Dwarves sometimes want to go for it. Obviously, dwarves are better loners in... Yeah, but I mean, that's... that's. You know, the thing is, if you've got a dwarf loner, you don't mind being at 11 players. You don't mind being 11 players. Whereas if you've got a uh, Norse loner, you don't like the fact that you've only got 11. But as a player, he's just better, isn't he? Because he's movement 6, so you're never going to have to do anything bad with him.
Funny that his mine all got fucked. Do I even want to do that? Do I just want to block? I want to dodge and run around and do nothing. I mean, dodging doesn't achieve anything. Coming through here doesn't achieve anything. So I guess just block. <laughs> I'll just make the safe move here. <laughs> Oh well, got a cat. Fair enough. <laughs> He's niggled. Wow. He would have been. Uh, he would have just been killed if he wasn't niggled. And she was a nine. Now, no, I the mad. It's not. It's not res now. It looks like a res game almost, doesn't it, with the number of skills? But um, it's uh, in Strippen and Crendor's league. It is. Fucking hell! Oh, he's got no rerolls left, so he could just fail a pickup and lose. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Imagine that. Could just roll a one here. Didn't pow! Outrageous! <laughs> it's, it's been easier to get a game in here than. Op it's this or open, though, isn't it? That's the thing, Squirrel Dude. It's this or open. It's not like. You know, it's not like playing in this instead of Champ's Ladder. It's literally this or open, so why not play in this one? I want to make three plus dodges, even with a real. So dodge with him, blitz with him, and then. Oh, but then can't clear that tackle zone. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, hand up. This is fucking horrible, isn't it? Oh my god. I just think that's a visual bug, yeah, in the display. Um, right. Right, let's just try a 3 plus to win. Or two 3 pluses to win. Alright, that will work quite well. How could it have been anything else? Maybe I should have just stood there and then rely on not getting powered. But getting powered is 30%, so it's better to GFI. Why well, got the corner so there's less chance of him getting blitzed? Would have been powered if he'd got blitzed. This game is everything Blood Bowl stands for. <laughs> yeah, it's slightly further from the go, isn't it? It'd be another GFI go on the corner. But maybe I should just stood there. 
and let him go three, four, five, six. He'd have to GFI and power me. Oh, well, there you go. Lucky field, anyway. So, yeah, I guess I shouldn't have made that GFI. But he would he would have a two plus he would all it all it would have needed was a two plus to two dice me. And then so I think it was I think it was definitely right just to go for the score. Are you shitting me? Oh my god, I've gotta i I've gotta go two nil up. Yeah, I think it was the right decision. I think it was the right decision because it was literally, even though he didn't have a reroll, it was a two plus, and then a two dice block to get me, wasn't it? It was pretty. It was pretty likely to um to get me down there. It was like thirty percent of eighty three, wasn't he? It was to... <sighs> All right, it's unlikely to be a loss now. Not to say that it won't be, but it's unlikely to be. Down to four players. It's still possible, but you never know. <laughs> Prowls are fun. If you can't field any, you lose. Um, the, a lot of VIP sort of the morning. The league is... Oh, Riot, excellent. Excellent. A free turn of stall there. And no rerolls. All right, should be. Should be. Um, the league is Strippen and Crendor's league. The saltiest plains, the salt flats, something like that. Yeah, the start of the drive, yeah. Believe that fucking trip wire. Can't believe that trip wire. Maybe I shouldn't have gone for it, but I think I think it was the right play to go for it. Could just blitz with him, couldn't he? <laughs> I got it. I got it in. A, I got it, squirrel dude, in fumble. I was the person who uh, who actually discovered the bug on fumble that it didn't it didn't actually uh it just the game just crashed when he couldn't when he couldn't set anybody up on the LOS. Which was pretty funny. Well the concession thing kind of applies. The the concessions still count as your uh as your concessions on champion ladder. But yeah the concession thing still still apply in terms of you get the MVP on that. Alright, get him. I 
good these are. <laughs> oh shit, these four players. Maybe three players. Oh, four. I think they say it doesn't work because of Champs Ladder. It still counts as one of your concessions in Champs Ladder. Blitzed him, but he's got sidestep, lodge step, in fact. Dirty dingo. Yeah, probably somebody has, yeah, El Mato. I haven't. Uh, sorry, Bush and El Mato. I haven't. Um, but yeah, maybe somebody has. Probably somebody's done it, but don't even know that they have. <laughs> Larson comes from a player on Fumble called Larson. Uh, who in one game, well, a perfect one is where you get the MVP as well. But it's when you get a uh, touchdown, casualty, and a completion, and an interception. Yeah. Definitely one now. Definitely. Oh man. <laughs> there was no need for this to be this this close and uh, stressful. Oh, he's up to seventeen now, that guy. Not bad. Still got my app, oh fuck it, put him on the line. I don't give a shit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's it, that's it, isn't it? And to be fair, that's another that's another thing about Inarian, isn't it? He does this kind of crazy stuff with the elves just because that's the sort of crazy stuff that elves do, and he's always using elves that are always getting bashed up a lot, so he gets a lot more opportunity to do crazy stuff like that. Like, you know, if, you, if you're playing Chaos, you don't really get to win 3 nil hardly ever. <laughs> you know, you get to win 3 nil if you cause 7 Kaz in the first half. Um, that's, when you get, that's when you get to win 3 nil. Um yeah, I think he is. Yeah, man, a race. To be honest, he hasn't. He hasn't done great. He has. I mean, he's got one reroll, and he's got a minor. So. Yeah, 12 lineman all team is good though. <laughs> I actually think there's nothing wrong with a 12 lineman orc team. I think orcs, I think orcs are super strong. Orc liners. I played a, I played a 12 lineman orc team on Fumble. Won like one nine games in a row. Only loss was to uh, only loss was to the team that won the blood bowl. No, was in the final of the blood bowl. Yeah, it is. Linox is a pretty. I'd probably be more comfortable with 12 Linox than Pro Elves. <laughs> I'm not really an elf type of person. No shit. Thought he might go for him with the uh, thing. Fuck. Right, he didn't die. 
Can't say fairer than that. Twelve orc throwers would be awful. I mean, t <laughs> it's I th I, now here, here's a question. Riddle me this, Batman. Is the orc thrower the only player, the only positional that stat line is worse than the lineman? I think it probably is. Assassin's got plus movement though, hasn't he? No, it doesn't. Assassin doesn't have plus movement. I'm being stupid. Oh, okay, Lord. Yeah, alright, fair enough. Dark Elf Assassin. Yeah. Are they the only two? Are they the only two then, Assassins? Assassins and Orc Throwers? Yeah, I was thinking of the I was thinking of the runner, to be honest, I was thinking of the runner. Yeah, the but the runner is movement seven. I was thinking of the runner. Um, yeah, it's not good company, is it? No, assassin. Is that is that it? Assassin. Yeah, the Kemi don't have thick score, but their stat line's better, isn't it? So, it's literally the Dark Elf Assassin and an Orc Thrower, the only positionals. The only positionals that are, uh, that are worse stat line than linemen. That's crazy, isn't it? No, I probably can't one turn here. I don't have a catcher. Alright. Definitely can't one turn. Get accomplished on somebody. Yeah, but even goblins have, although they're strength 2 and armor 7, they've got plus 1 movement, don't they? So, goblins have something gone for them over a, over an orc lineman, whereas, whereas they, they've got nothing, have they? Uh, orc throwers, they are absolutely just worse. Yeah, they've got stunty as well, yeah, that's true. Shame I don't get to foul. Don't have enough players to foul. <laughs> oh wow, punched him into next week. Ah well, cunning fox, but you shouldn't. You still shouldn't have five rerolls with fans. You Should only have four. No need for five ever. Don't tell me you've got a two vampire team. Um, right, Red Bull Wings. He made 13 AV breaks. And... Uh, he didn't even... It wasn't even that crazy. It was just all of his injuries were... Uh, were cars weren't they? They weren't KOs, they were just all cars. It was brutal. Did quite well escaping from tents, to be fair. Pickup rolls actually made a lot of them. It just it just seemed worse than it was. Dodges weren't great, but some were three pluses. So there you go, that makes the dice look not even crazy, but it it, it sure felt crazy. 
and all those ones. But um not oh, GFIs. Three one. It was just, it was just the timing of them all, wasn't it? it? Just seemed crazy, and the double one on the pass and stuff like that. I guess he's got to take tackle. There's, there's nothing else. He's always got bludged there. He's just left with tackle, isn't he? And then like diving tackle. They are a bit crap without stats or doubles. He probably just wants blocks to uh, to hit stunties, seeing as there's probably a, a fair few of them. Um, well, you go, not bad. One, unbelievably, despite not having any players. Um, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.